that, how do you feel training camp's going for you and uh, how you've been progressing? I feel like I've been doing well, you know, uh, having a couple good days here, a couple mistakes days here, but, you know, I still got a lot to work on and finish up, but uh, I think I'm having a great camp uh, competing every day and, you know, looking at the uh, uh, starting role, hopefully, so. You feel like you've done enough at this point to, to warrant that, that consideration? Um, I think, uh, you know, we're, we're all battling as hard uh, together as a team, and, you know, it's, I feel like I've done enough, but, you know, I'm still going to give credit to the seniors that are doing a lot, too. Like, we're all doing a lot on the, on the field, and uh, we'll see what happens. Are you pretty much locked in left tackle right now, or are you getting some? Um, I'm getting some reps at right, right tackle, too. We're, we're down in tackle right now, and, uh, you know, um, I'm, I'm switching over from left to right to left to right. So, you know, it's, uh, it's all good, but once we're back full strength, I'll be a back at left. Your left tackle is where you like to yeah. play? Yeah, that's where I like to play. Well, why do you like it so much? I uh, just I've been playing there my whole life since high school, and you know when I first started as a lineman, I was on the left side, so you know, that's where I like to be. Is that uh, almost not, not really a burden, but something that, that you have to protect that quarterback blind side? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I I like to do that. You know, I like taking on the responsibility. Uh, you know, it makes me feel uh, I don't know a, a little bit more important, but you know <laughs> a little bit more responsibility. So yeah. How do you feel the line as a whole is gelling right now? I think we're all coming together as a, as a good squad right now. We've uh, had a great off season together. We've been working, uh, you know, every day after weightlifting and stuff like that. So, you know, it, it's been good. I think we're all coming together, and uh, it's going to be a great year for us. Man, you've been on the verge of being an everyday guy since it seems like since you got here. What's different? What do you think will is elevated your game to be ready for this? Uh, I think my experience, my experience here. Uh, you know, going against this great defensive line every day, but coached by a great coach, and you won't find a better defensive line gets that much effort. So I think, uh, you know, my experience in playing and, you know, the, the good work that the defensive line gives me, for sure. You mentioned you guys getting together. How much is there discussion about getting that run game going? What are those conversations? Oh, like? yeah, we, we, we always have high, high expectations for ourselves. We, we like to talk positively about ourselves. And, uh, yeah, I think we all, we, you know, we try to help each other when we're out there, you know, uh, you know, uh, focus on like different techniques and, uh, you know, double teams and stuff like that. So, yeah. Do you see the running game getting better? Tuesday, uh, as you said, it wasn't so great on Saturday. Um, I, I do see it getting better. I, th I think, uh, you know, like I said, experience. We've we got our experienced offensive line now. You know, we've got two starters from last year out, but I think uh, it's, it's time to step up and, you know, I think we all know our responsibilities, know what to do, and you know, know how to really control the run game. So. You, you mentioned experience. How much did those few starts last year really help, uh, you know, I guess, within your progression? Yeah. I mean, it, it helped me uh, tremendously, just just with confidence. Uh, you know, it, when you go out there and play, you know, your first time at Austin P, it's not a start, but, you know, it's, you know, when you get to start those full games, Virginia Tech, Clemson, Georgia Tech, it, it gives you a lot of confidence, and you know, you know what to expect. Were there any nerves for you with the Clemson game going down? You know? for, for, for sure. I mean, that first drive, and hearing that, you know, half capacity crowd, it, felt, it sounded like a full crowd out there. So, you know, it was, it was a little nerve wracking out there, but after the first couple of plays, you're, you're right into it. The adrenaline kicks in and you're ready to go. Man, you mentioned how close you guys work together. It's a dynamic when a new guy, Brian, is. Um, we, we welcome full, uh, you know, welcome arms, open arms, and stuff like that. We try to, you know, develop them into our. Our run game techniques, our pass game techniques, everything we do. So you know, it's, I think I think it brings us closer because uh, you know we can you know develop him as one of us, and you know I think it's just all around it all come together and of course it goes. What was the level of excitement on the line at uh, Kenny's sponsorship deal? How much are <laughs> you looking forward to some of those dinners? Yeah, now? I, I'm looking forward to it. It's it's a it's a good uh, it's a good opportunity to get some meals in. You know, we're we're we're, uh, we're happy Kenny did that for us. We respect him a lot for it. So you know, it's it's exciting. How nice is it to have a quarterback that uh, seems to care so much about the guys up front? It's awesome. It's awesome. It's, it means the world to us. I like, beyond believe it. It means the absolute world to us. So, yeah. You ordered the most expensive steak on the menu? I didn't. I just ordered a burger for the first time. And <laughs> steaks are a little bit too, too expensive. So, you know, I just went for the burger. That's what we do. Is food a good motivator? Yeah, I think, I think it is. You know, we've got something to look forward to every week. So, I think we'll, uh, you know, take that and just run along with it. So, yeah. The, uh, the run game has been a big emphasis this offseason. Having three good tackles, there was anyone kind of standing out swing, or is that, has that been a position of emphasis? I well? think we're all competing uh, to, to, a, uh, to a high level right now. You know, I'm not, I'm not sure who's going to be, you know, in ones or you know, starting, but you know, you know, I think we're all really working hard. You know, I think we got some of the best tackles in the nation here, and I think 
um, it's going it's to be a good season for us and we can really all develop and want to get together. What's it like to feel the wrath from Coach Borbley if something goes wrong? <laughs> uh, it's, it's not a good feeling, but, you know, yeah, uh, I, I took that last year, you know, a couple of times when I didn't start. You know, he would, he would be hard on me, but you know what? He helped me out and got me ready for Virginia Tech, Clemson, and all that. So, you know, I, I appreciate when he's hard on us and stuff like that. It uh, it, it, it boosts us, and I, I think it's going to help us later in the future just in life, too. Anything else? You said you had 15 and 10 in high school basketball. Would you be on the starting five if Pitt football had a basketball team? I think I, uh, I think I would. I think I would uh, as a big man, not maybe a six man or something like that as a big man, rebounder, you know, the defense, maybe something like that. So I hope so. Are there many on that team? Um, I don't, I don't really know. I, I haven't played too much basketball around us to, 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 you know, to know the full five. But I, I, I think I can make it out there. I think I can compete. Brandon Taylor is pretty good in high school. Oh, yeah. Brent, I, yeah, Brent, I think he could be out there, too. I, I know Brandon Taylor is pretty good. So, Did you meet many 300-pounders on a basketball court, though? No, I didn't. No. Uh, you were the biggest guy out there, of, Yeah, yeah, in Long Island. A couple, couple here and there, but I don't think anybody up to my size. And, you know, it's, it's just, I don't know. I'm, I'm bigger than most Do you guys. see guys backing away from you when you go for a rebound? <laughs> sometimes, sometimes, yeah, but, like, you know, just uh, every day, you know, I bet down. I, I don't know how to explain it, so.